comes Vedant here. So, how are you all? After three months, I am uploading a new video and I really apologize for that. But before starting this video, let me wish you all a very happy new year. We're already 15 days in and hope this year brings you a lot of joy and happy reading. So, in this video, as you might have expected, today I'm going to be reviewing the second book of the Maze Runner series, which is The Maze Runner, The Scotch Triads. So, this is the cover design of this book. So, in the last book, we left off when Teresa, Chuck and Thomas had gone into the next stage of the trials that was conducted by Wicked, the creators of the maze. So after they had gone to the next stage, stage of the trials, unfortunately, Chuck died. And in this video, I am going to be telling you some spoilers. So I will be creating a separate section in which there will be spoilers of this book and you can skip accordingly. So after they entered the compound in which the all the other gladers were held, what happened exactly was that Thomas lost his telepathic connection with Teresa. Somehow, in some way, nobody knows. And the second big thing that happened in the compound, they found a random kid called Aris and they befriended him and took him along in the next stage of the trials, which was the Scotch trials. Now, Teresa had gone to experiment number two of these trials. And the experiment number two, or you can say group B, had kept all girls. And Teresa was actually earlier in group A with all boys. And Aris was also actually with group B, which is experiment number two, held by Wicked, which was filled with girls. And you can see how well this is planned. This is planned by Wicked, the creators of the maze. Wicked planned this to work simultaneously and to figure out how the people, how the gladers react to this. So let us get into the nitty gritty part of this book. So as Thomas could converse telepathically with Teresa, Thomas was able to converse telepathically with Aris. Now that is the most bizarre thing that happened in this book. So after these all things happened, they went through the Scorch Trials. So Scorch, first of all, they went to Scorch in the compound which, in which they were held. Uh, the compound was located in Scorch. So Scorch was basically a barren wasteland. And it was basically a desert and basically it had cracks. Now, there is a specific virus in the world right now in this book called the flares called the flare now this virus is so deadly that it affects your kill zone yes kill zone means your head your brain and it affects so heavily that you go crazy you go insane and you go bust the gone and once you go past the gone you are crazy and you are ready to beat the hell out of anyone you are ready to go crazy and you are ready to do anything that you want and you are ready to eat anyone eat any human being even if they are living so this is how bad the flare is now let us talk a little bit about wicked now in the last video I gave you a brief about Wicked. So Wicked actually means World in Catastrophe Kill Zone Experiment Department. So Wicked 
was started to stop this flare virus. So their main aim is to find a cure to this virus. And they are studying patterns of the kill zone or your head so that they can make blueprints and find the cure to this virus. So the people, Thomas the Gladers, had actually had to move a hundred miles out in two weeks. In two weeks was the time period to move hundred miles straight, hundred miles north to find the safe heaven. So in the safe heaven, they will be kept safe and they will be moved to the probably the next uh, thing that Wicket has planned. So this is the spoiler section. So if you want to skip this part, you can. And if you don't want to know the spoilers or if you plan to read this book, you should definitely skip this part. So ready for the spoiler guys. So the spoiler is that Teresa and Thomas had beaten up Thomas brutally and Teresa had actually betrayed Thomas. And later on in this book, Teresa and Thomas say, uh, Teresa, and later on in this book, Teresa and Alice just said it was all an act. So imagine this. If someone is beating you brutally and, and then they say it was all a play, it was all an act, I'm really sorry for this. How would you feel? You would feel obviously the other person cheated on you or the other person betrayed you. Definitely uh, the, this was understandable with Thomas. And Thomas had from then on was starting to hate Teresa. And then later on in this book, they go in a burg and then they probably reach the headquarters of Wicked where they are being held. Now, the next book will be more interesting than this book and I guarantee you this. And so I'm going to meet you guys in the next video and probably with the third and the final book of this Maze Runner trilogy. So till then, happy reading and goodbye.